Have you always been this disciplined? Yes. Wow. <laughs> I hate you. And that's what everyone's like. And this is not a self disparaging comment in any way, but like, you know, as well as anybody, never been a anything pet, playmate, centerfold, cover girl, treat of the month, never, ever anything. So while I think I'm um, a woman. I believe somebody in this conversation has won MILF Performer of the Year. Sure, that's a performer And I can thing. tell you yeah. that person is not me. <laughs> and that's a performer thing. But I think that my skills, even in an industry of beauty, are not beauty. Do you know what I mean? Like mm. I'm a reasonably attractive woman, but my success is clear. Like I haven't like, you see the girls playmate, penthouse, hustler, twi you know, they do, they're just stunning, you know? Mm. So that was never me. So it's business, dependability, personality. I'm MILF performer of the year. Yes, I have energetic, good performances, but I get hired a lot because I show up, I have my wardrobe. Like mm. I've given opportunity, I've memorized my scripts before, before, oh, I show up on set. Do you know what I mean? So I'm given opportunity after opportunity after opportunity to play roles that at one point were above my, you know, pay grade. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because I'll fucking show up. And then it became my pay grade. And now here I am with all, do you know what I mean? So there's mm -hmm. lots of ways to, you know, skin a cat, I guess. You know, you yeah, no, it's true. It's I, I remember... Community. I remember when uh, you were, I believe it was for Flesh too, for Digital Playground, mm -hmm. and which you were in. And I believe not only did, because we always print out scripts for the talent because they almost never do, right? They're like, oh, it's on my phone. I'm going to yeah, read sure. it in the makeup chair. I believe yours <laughs> was- A 75 page script. <laughs> was had like color coded tabs in a three oh, ring yes. binder and like your lines were highlighted. I was- I was so, so impressed. I was so impressed. I was like, what the, who is this person? <laughs> who is this person? <laughs> yeah. So I feel like, you know, I have the other things enough to be in this industry, right. but I certainly wasn't, you know, handed anything because of my beauty. So thank God I have those other skills because if anybody asks, that's why I'm successful. I, you, you know, know I my, mean, my Snapchat has been going on for three years. I haven't missed a single day that feed has never been dead i've had surgery i've had family crises i've had death like if netflix went down often would you keep paying 30 dollars a month fuck no my yeah. super fans the 200 people that are going to buy my shit no matter what will but to everyone else it's just porn and if yeah. you don't give a good product not the week when you're feeling good but all the fucking time you know, that's how I compete. I don't yeah. compete because my stuff is better. I compete because it's always fucking there. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, make sure that you subscribe so you don't miss a single episode and go check out all the other videos. I film every single one of my podcasts. And if you want to listen to the audio version, I'm on iTunes and all the other podcast platforms. Visit hollyrandallunfiltered.com to find out more.